Hi babies and welcome back to my channel. In today's video we're gonna do a DIY. So do it yourself because you got no money to spend. Also because you just wanna laugh at me. So I make terrible decision and I will show you something that you shouldn't do because it's just gonna literally fuck up. Anyways, we are going to do the black mask to remove a black head. So I'm quite excited. So I am going to show you what we need. First, we need a bowl. I got a clear bowl so that you can actually see a little bit better what I'm doing. Then we need uh, some glue and I'm using the Pret Kids Art because why not? Then we're going to use some um, Bourbon Prime Essential Oil, so something a little bit more saturated for the skin so that we just don't pull straight up glue. Then we are going to use, because it's me, to give it a little bit of extra colour, some glitter. So you don't actually really need glitter, but I was like, it's gonna look cute, right? And some um, black powder, so charcoal will be fine. I'm using a crushed up eyeshadow. I, don't, I can't really show you as much, so I'll try my both. Just like so. Oh, you'll see how we go there. But it's just some crushed up eyeshadow that I had around. So, I think we should just start. So first things we need, uh, also we need a brush. To just like, something that you actually want to throw away after because I don't think we can save it. So don't use your best foundation brush. So first things we're going to do, we're going to have the bowl just here. Open up our glue and, sure, open up glue, oh, done, <laughs> and we're just gonna like squirt a little bit, like, uh, that's enough, eh. that's enough, we are only gonna do my nose and my cheeks, I'm trying to avoid all my beard hair and maybe we do it just a little bit on the forehead, not sure yet, we'll see how we go. Then we are going to like put down the powder just like so, so we can see all the powder here. I'm also gonna take a little bit of the glitter. Ooh, fancy. Can you see this? I don't think you can, but it's just like, wait. Super pretty. Oh, this looks gorgeous already. And then some essential oils. This one are the classic by MAC. I'm only going to put one, two, three, four, five drops. I think five drops is enough. We don't want to overdo. Now we're going to take our foundation brush and blend them two together. And it looks already like... Oh, okay. So, I don't know if you can see. Smell just like glue, so the smell is actually nasty. But why don't we just put it on? So it's nice and mixed it, and before it completely sets down, I think we don't really have much time. We're gonna apply this one. So yes, I'm scared. But anyways, uh, what I'm gonna do, I am going to apply. It Oh, this beautiful mask that I just create everywhere I feel I can actually take it off after. I'm worried to do a really close to my beard. And I'm also gonna be off camera because I think it's gonna take quite a while to dry out. But I'm, I'm going to tell you how long did it take. So cue the music, baby, because we're gonna apply the mask right now. So the mask is gone down and is now, let me check, let me check, let me check. 548 so we are now gonna take our time I'm going to do some crafting and decoupage because I still have lots of glue that I have to use and yeah that's it I will see you when uh, this thing is a uh, dry mm -mm. dry I hope so would it ever dry it will dry right <laughs> Yeah. 
been about 30 minutes and this mask is not really going to dry any more than this because I think I put too much essential oil inside so we can see if we can actually peel some of it oh let's check uh, oh okay oh yeah so it will peel only like in a little bit it doesn't look like it's probably gonna peel all in one, but let's check. Ooh. This thing does nothing. Ouch. Ooh, my forehead is grabbing so much more. I like that. Ooh, uh, uh. It, it actually doesn't hurt, but is my nose running as I'm pulling it? So that's really silly. Ah. Well, at least I can say that on the top was dry. So here we have it. This is like the most part on my forehead as you can see there is actually nothing really coming out except a lot of like really baby hair so I have to say at least it did take off a lot of my baby hair that they come on my forehead so yeah also you can't really see as much like the red glitter that I put it on so it was a little bit silly doing this way as we were all expected this monk did absolutely nothing zero nada well, actually, the only things that did remove the hair from my forehead that I didn't even know I had. So that kind of made me feel even more uncomfortable. I'd be like, did I have hair on my forehead that I didn't even know? So yeah, that wasn't really a great discovery for today. It was, I have to say, quite fun. So if you guys really enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you have any suggestion about future DIY, please leave it down below because I need some ideas from you guys because you're clever. I am the body, I make you the mind. Anyway guys, I make video every Monday and Thursday, so please stay subscribed. But always remember, like if you like, hate if you hate, and until next time, you're welcome. <laughs>